Hey guys, it's a girl, Isabel, and today I'm going to be piercing my own ears. Yes, you heard that right. I'm going to be piercing my own ears. So, I actually got my ears pierced back in fourth grade. But my dad did not find that was a really good idea, so he made me take off my earrings and... Yeah. So, I've recently been really wanting to get my ears pierced. Like, I don't know why, but... Now more than ever, I've been really been wanting to get my ears pierced. So, I'm going to do it right now, and... Thanks to the internet, I think I'm going to do this pretty well. So, I already washed my hands. I have all the supplies that I need. Um, the earrings that I'm going to be putting on are actually in there. And I'm actually just using a sewing needle. So, let's actually get this ready. So, these the earrings that I'm using have already been in here for two minutes, which is the recommended time to be in there, in the water. They were in benzoyl peroxide. So, I'm going to take them out. Just have them ready because I'm about to do it. So, um, in alcohol, I already had in alcohol for a while now. So, now that my needle is clean, um, I'm gonna dry it real quick. I'm honestly kind of nervous because, you know, piercing my own ear. Crazy, right? Um, I mean, I hope this is my first and last time piercing. A second and last time piercing my ear, so. So I'm going to try to do this process super duper quick. I'm not going to, like, I'm just going to really quick just puncture it in there. That's what I'm going for. Because the first time I got my ears pierced, my mom did it for me. And as much as I can remember, I can remember that. This time, this time it's going to be quick, easy, and hopefully won't hurt. So, so quick. I'm not going to numb my ears, just because I don't want to, um, I'm going to skip that step. <coughs> yes, I am really nervous about this. So, I got a bar soap, so basically what you're supposed to do is hold it behind here so that you can puncture it. I'm going to go to the mirror right now because I obviously want to see what I'm doing. So I'm sorry, guys. This way. I don't know if I can do this, guys. I'm already getting my head and my heart is beating. Like I feel like my brain is open. So it already went through, and I'm dying right now. Like, it doesn't, it hurts, but I wanted this, so, whatever. So now I'm going to pull this out. I have a hole in my ear now, and I'm about to put this in. My hands are shaking. I honestly think I need to redo this. It appears right. Okay, well, it did go through. You guys can see that, right? Like my.
So I'm back guys, I'm no longer nauseous and wanting to die, but this is how it's looking. So I couldn't get the whole through as you guys saw in the last clip, <clears throat> and I think I'm going to just do this in here for a really long time, because I don't want to take it out and then have to repuncture a hole in the back again, because it's too much, so I'm just trying to kind of get this used to being in there. I'll tell you guys the progress. I'm sorry for the background noise, but I finished it finally. And I think it's pretty even to be honest. Like, I put it at a good place. And then also, I haven't done the other year, which I don't know if I want to because I'm really scared. And as you guys saw the first time when I made the hole and I got it through, I got really nauseous and I felt like like throwing up and just fainting. But um, I don't think that's going to happen with this year since I already did it once. But... It was really hard to finally get the earring in, and when I finally did, it made like this really big popping noise, um, even after I had already made the hole. I don't know why, but yeah. You like? So now that I did it once, I'm gonna do it super quickly on this ear, and I'm gonna just time lapse it, and then yeah, that's it. So just so you guys can see me do both of them, but obviously this one was more of a learning experience, and I really hope none of them get detected. So now I got it done, and I'm gonna leave it in there for like five minutes. And I feel like this one's kind of, like, I don't know, I don't think I put it at a right place. Like, this one is, like, a perfect place. It's okay. It's okay. And it actually does hurt. Like, this one hurts. I don't know. This one hurts more, I feel like. Hey, guys. Isabel from two, two days later. It's Sunday. That was on Friday, that video that you were watching. And just to update you guys. I did finish it. See, I did this one and this one. I forgot to update you guys, but yeah, I did end up finishing it as you can tell. Um, and also, when I did this one, I actually just redid this one like two days because, as you guys saw, when I made the hole, I made it like too slanted, so the earring was like that, and you could see the back through the front, like you could see the back of the earring with me with like this angle you guys are in um so i ended up redoing it but <laughs> yeah i'm really happy with how it turned out so all right and i want you guys to not forget to like comment and subscribe and then also go add my snapchat because that's where i update the most and my snapchat knew about this before my instagram or my youtube because i did post it on my instagram too so yeah if you want to get updated with me the most Go on Snapchat. If you want to get updated with me a little bit, then go on Instagram. And then Twitter, I tweet a lot. So yeah, peace out.